How's it going guys and welcome to my channel. Here's uh, another movie review for The Incredibles 2. Actually, it's Incredibles 2. But yeah, uh, I've seen this movie twice already and I gotta say, it's really good. It was really good. I enjoyed the movie from beginning to the end. Um, I love the family chemistry. I enjoy more of the scenes of Bob Parr, Mr. Incredible at home with his kids. I really enjoy those scenes all the way Jack Jack with um Dash, Violet, um not not a lot with um Helen, Elastic Girl. It had her moments. There was moments that it was really good, but most of the film I enjoyed more of Mr. Incredible and with the kids. That was just those scenes were so funny. And I gotta say no spoilers, Jack Jack steals this movie. From beginning to end, he just the MVP of this film, and I gotta say, they overpowered his abilities, his skills a lot. He has like twenty plus powers than any of them, seriously. But Jack Jack, it's so he's really funny. Um, and they say Amber, no, I don't want to spoil it. Edna. As you see in the trailer, she's back. She's funny too. I like the way she is. Um, Frozen, he has a lot of things to do now compared with the first one. He was limited. But on this one, he, he has a lot to do also, which I enjoyed him a lot. Other than that, this movie is really good. I enjoyed it. And I gotta say, if I'm gonna compare the first one with the second one, um, slightly, just by... By a bit, I gotta say, Incredibles 2, it's a little bit, a little bit better than the first one. Um, the villain on the second one, it didn't work out for me. So that's just one negative out of, pretty much there's no, that's the only negative I have about the film. Um, the villain, it, there was no background, there was no motive, not a lot. The main reason there was nothing I just didn't like the villain compared to the first one syndrome he was he had a motivation he want to be part like a team up with Mr. Credible be someone but Mr. Credible pushed them away so he felt like rejected and that gave him reason for syndrome to to do what he he did in the first film on the second one not not a lot nothing was like that compared to the first one but overall this film film it's really enjoyable to watch um i recommend it so if, if you guys haven't seen it go check it out it opened 180 million dollars opening weekend so was it a long way yeah it was really long way but the 14 year gap it was worth it and i gotta say finally the incredibles 2 is here and it's another perfect movie of pixar that they did so props to the director Brad Bird and the cast. Um, hopefully, there's Incredible th Incredibles three, because I I would I love the the family chemistry. I just want to see more of them each time. Walking out of the second out of the theaters, it just wanted me to to see more of them. So hopefully, there's Incredibles three. Hopefully, we don't have to wait fourteen years, another fourteen years. Hopefully, it's as soon as possible. Overall, this is a good film. If you like my video my review of this film incredible suit comment like subscribe and share and i'll see you guys on the next video